cloud. It's funny Niagara because Falls. it's it's like it it took so long to sort of reach yeah. where we got close Can to it getting that? darker, and then just like that. Listen Here to the, the people. Cheers. The people's cheering because they can see it in Niagara Falls. Listen to the joy happening yeah, right now. See, they've got it there. There's the shot. Yeah, is it? Good whoa! For them. Is that back in Dunkirk? On the right oh, side of your falls. screen. Good for them. Niagara Falls, Ooh, Niagara wow. Falls experiencing totality. Very nice. All day long, we thought it was going to be too cloudy yeah. in Niagara Falls. Wow. And right there, you can see during the moment of totality, yes. just the edge of the sun revealed there as the moon is blocking it. I have to it. say the clouds are really pretty when you have the solar eclipse because of all the different shadows cast upon them. I have chills. Did you see the kids running and jumping around? You can hear people shouting and screaming, you know, okay, we so weren't sure, but there it is. This is the moment right now when you're coming oh, out wow. of totality. Right. We saw this with a few of the other spots. So now is the moment when you need to put the glasses back on. Yes. But just like that, it sort of the light changes, right? You see that bright light for just a moment, and now there's a sliver of yeah, the sun right. that's going to be showing, and and it'll it'll start to get brighter here pretty quickly. We had that totality, we had that absolute darkness, and then the sun is coming back to us. It is getting lighter out here in yes. downtown Buffalo. From what I just couldn't make out, a couple of. Yeah. Uh, down my coworkers who were enjoying down uh, to the right of me. Yeah, look, look at the that clear skies shot. over there and that left shot. That sliver coming yeah. back to us now. Beautiful. There again is our live camera with the filter on it. So we've made it past totality. Yeah. Now we have the long journey back to normalcy. This oh, is still man. quite a moment right now. We're um, still in it. You know, we have an over. hour and 10 we're minutes left and it goes until 432. So an hour and 10 minutes There's left. There's still so much this. to enjoy. So it's yes. time to get those glasses back on. Make yeah. sure everyone and is enjoying Hopefully we can scour weather. away some of these clouds too. Yeah. Even right now though, compared to, to one minute ago, it is so significantly I know, brighter it is. outside. It's, it's crazy amazing. just how quickly wow. it comes and goes. Right. That was wild. Can we just like talk about what just happened here? That I wish was we wild. could savor that. That was insane. And it was what, four <laughs> minutes? It did not feel like four no. minutes. No. We were sitting here in complete darkness at right. three o'clock in the afternoon. I know. That it's was crazy. so awesome. I hope that you are with your loved ones and are really taking that moment in and you took a moment to look around for that experience because that was sick, frankly. It was. <laughs> it was awesome. This is so and when cool. will we? We'll probably never see this again, right? Yeah. Unless we travel to some other country. Maybe, yeah, I know. Unless right? exactly. like twenty-one forty-four <laughs> yes. is the next time this is happening here. So you got that once in a lifetime yes. moment right here in Western New York. And the thing is, too, to be in the path of totality and to get to experience almost four minutes of darkness yeah. um, is a is a very unique thing. <laughs> there are not many places on the right. globe that fall on that right. very thin line of totality. We are very, we're fortunate. very fortunate. Yes, we are very fortunate to be in it. Wow, happy to be here with you guys. Happy to have Absolutely. this moment. Absolutely, this is wonderful. Enjoy that. And now we're look at the clouds that changing back. colors. Just as the sun comes out, look at these clouds changing. It's They're like morphing. A, it's like a sunrise it's or like a sunset painting. but up in the up in the top of the sky which yeah, we never get it's to like experience. a painting and look at the birds are flying now yeah. wow. they're, they're back very, in business listen the birds are confused <laughs> imagine at the buffalo business. zoo right now the animals are like the bunny's what? back oh, away that is here. gorgeous he's, he's look jumping. at that oh my gosh it looks so yeah. celestial yeah. drops on the camera it's beautiful what a great shot oh, can we talk for lovely. a moment about niagara falls all day long it appeared as if we the falls was not going to get to experience this, yeah. and then exactly during totality, right in they that had moment. that moment where yeah. the clouds parted just exactly. enough, and the folks there were able to experience. I totality. think that was missed from the falls on the camera. Oh, is that what that was? Yeah, because oh, there's goodness. no showers around oh, here good. right now. Well, how incredible! Yeah, but for it's everyone, beautiful. Just the look at that sky. Incredible. It's gorgeous for everyone there in Niagara Falls. That is exactly now, what they waited right, for. Right, but you yeah. wouldn't see a sky like this if it was totally blue. Right. You know, it would just be a totally different picture. The but shadows. this is fascinating. Yeah. It is really fascinating. All right, we mentioned how Niagara Falls really hit the jackpot here. No pun intended with the casinos. Our Leah Lando <laughs> is live there now. Leah, it did not look super promising maybe a half hour or an hour ago, but you got to experience totality there and see it for just a moment. Boy, I tell you, I mean, you have to be here to know what that was like. I heard you guys talking about it, and I was literally yelling, come to me, come to me, so I can explain. I mean, it was just amazing because the energy kind of dropped significantly when people thought, oh, perhaps we're not going to get to see it. We drove all this way. We have people from all over the world here. We're talking about tens of thousands, perhaps hundreds of thousands of people looking up at the sky, and the, it was covered. And then all of a sudden, 
we got to see it through. I mean, it was just absolutely beautiful. The birds were going crazy over the falls. I mean, it's, it's hard to explain and it was just a beautiful thing and everyone was cheering. And now there are, uh, looks like people are starting to um, trickle out just a little bit, still looking up to see if they have anything left to capture here. But a lot of people that I have talked to, you know, they've been waiting for this for so long. So wow. yes, as you said, awesome that we actually did get to see it because it was really disappointing leading up to it thinking, oh no, we're not gonna get to see it. But, and that's how it was for you guys there, right? Yeah. It was incredible. Leah, talk about that moment of totality, right? When you saw the sun go completely, uh, the moon go completely in front of the sun and we didn't think we would see it in Niagara Falls. We heard the cheers. What was that like to be in that moment? It's just unifying, you know, NASA is set up right next to me and I'm listening to them because they're doing a, a live broadcast and they said, what a gift that we actually did get that little bit of a peak in the clouds. So we got to see the totality and the, just the beautiful light around it. I, I think I captured a pretty good image with my phone as well, but just being here, one of the wonders of the world, experiencing something that we'll get to see once in our lifetime, right? It's just amazing. And Leah, and it, the birds. I mean, I heard you guys talking about that. Leah, it's Mary Beth. Um, when you saw it, did you see the beautiful yeah. light sh uh, shined upon all the clouds around it? It looks so celestial. You're right, it did. And it was a nice surprise because we were just sitting here looking up and not expecting that to happen. So it was, it was absolutely beautiful. Leah, yeah, the other thing I want to ask you about is just the, even in the, the few minutes leading up to totality, just the darkness. We were showing a live camera from Josh Nichols location um, at the observation deck and Niagara Falls ju just to see it go so dark and all the lights in the buildings come on. Um, that was a really remarkable thing to see too. How, how did you uh, how did you experience that? Yeah, I mean, it, uh, it would it just felt like nighttime. But then when the birds started acting like they did, I mean, there was there, there were so many of them just flying over the falls you realize, you know, this is something different. But again, we were disappointed because we all were thinking, oh no, we're not gonna get to see anything. But then we saw it for a little while, so it was great. But you know, Michael, the other thing is um, we've talked about this for so long. So of course the anticipation has been huge. And then we've talked about the perhaps the problem of people leaving all at once and a lot of people I've spoken to said that they are leaving right after the main event and I do see some people trickling out. Uh, there was a group of guys behind me who came from New York City. I talked to them, probably about seven of them, and they said, oh, we're leaving immediately after. Uh, family who came from Virginia, they're leaving immediately after and I'm just watching people walk out now. So. The main event is over, so now it's the <laughs> traffic, and if all these people are gonna hit the road at the same time, obviously that's a concern. But yes, just overall, um, a lot of emotions here today because the people were so worried that they weren't gonna get to see it, so every time the sun peaked out prior to it, hours leading up to it, they would cheer, they would stand up and cheer, and so um, it's so great that they came all this way and they, they got to see a great show. And it, it, you heard a lot of people talk about how unifying this has been everyone coming together for, for one thing here in Niagara Falls, New York, and it hasn't happened in so long. So pretty cool. The thing I would, would remind people, and Mary Beth has been saying this all day long, is all the anticipation leading up to it, we now get to go in, through in reverse. So right. for the people there in Niagara Falls, stick yeah. around. I because think they should stick around too. They're gonna have some clearing of the clouds yes. and they're gonna yes. get to see <laughs> it sort of reveal. Yeah. Right. People should, uh, yeah. they should stay put I think, for I think, a while. Um, yeah, can you still hear me? Yeah. Oh, yeah, so I, I wish there was a way for us to put up a huge big screen TV over the falls so you could make that announcement because people are actually, Lou, can you show him, can you show them how people are starting to leave this way, crowds of people. Wow, no the people. Way. So they're coming you guys up are and they're starting this. to leave, so. Wow, people packing up their I know, bags. I know. You want me to yell? Should I yell to them? <laughs> yeah, 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 y
<laughs> Tell them that we've got more because you know fingers crossed those clouds will clear <laughs> and there will be this experience that we were leading up to in reverse. Some people still got those glasses on sticking around for a little bit, but look at that mass exodus of Niagara yeah, Falls that's wow. happening yeah, there. Look at the crowd, yeah. But there's still time. There's still yeah. time. There is still time for Absolutely. sure. We do want to remind everybody, I mean, we do anticipate because some people, you know, that those are their plans, right? Hop they want to see it, here. they're experiencing it, it's now getting brighter, right. so they're going to be leaving. We'll be following all that very closely this evening to make sure that there are no problems.